Now to a major endorsement today for someone with a well known last name who is running for Congress. Yeah, the name Pierce Bush. Now he has the backing of the man he's hoping to replace. Ron Trevino has the story from Sugarland. Pierce Bush is facing more than a dozen other Republicans in the upcoming primary for Congressional District 22, but he's hoping that the endorsement he got today will give him the edge. It came from retiring Congressman Pete Olson. <laughs> Olson says he's backing Bush because he thinks he can win. Pierce Bush is the grandson of President George H.W. Bush and the nephew of President George W. Bush. And while he only recently moved to this district, he says he's no stranger here. This is a community I know well. I've had the honor of serving the entire district, not just a portion. Uh, and it's a, it's a community that I think represents what's best about this incredible country. Bush hopes to serve in a huge district that stretches from Fort Bend County to Southeast Harris County, once considered Republican territory, but now many say it's up for grabs. I would say that Fort Bend is, if not already blue, clearly more competitive than it's ever been. Could it mean a Democrat could be elected to Congress from this district? Well, I'm convinced with the right messaging, the values are so aligned that we will be able to build a really strong coalition that keeps this a conservative Republican district. A Pierce Bush with a Pete Olson endorsement could hold the seat come November 2020. Stein says today's endorsement is that big. Of course, all the other Republicans running and the Democrats as well will have a lot to say about that in the coming days and weeks in what many consider the tightest congressional race in Texas. In Sugarland, Ron Trevino, KHOU 11 News.